Morning, how are you doing? Wow, that's so good. Amazing. Wait, you didn't even say anything? Oh, whoopsies. I'm about to make breakfast and I'm gonna make it fast because I'm hungry and I don't want to chat. Okay, this is what I'm gonna ask. So today I'm going to try my best to have the most average day of eating because I'm trying to get an accurate representation of how I normally eat. You may be thinking, why am I counting my calories when I never do that? Honestly, my reason sounds really off but here is what i was thinking i have a goal of gaining weight and i have a goal of building muscle and i've had this goal for a very long time you guys know i've i've put it on my youtube channel i feel like it was like a year ago i want to gain weight and i'm struggling to get anywhere at first i try to just casually increase my food but i think anxiety got in the way and so my idea was to figure out how many calories do i actually eat in a day and use that as a reference to increase my food and have a sufficient daily calorie goal and yes looking back I didn't think it through properly and my mom pointed it out Afraid emotions getting in your way Afraid So this is what I'm doing today mother I'm tracking my calories for the entire day to see how much I actually eat which will help me because I want to eat more So I was watching Mandy Rose and she was doing this like video about how like tips to gain weight, tips to build muscle. And she was like, you have to track your calories. And I know that that's not something that I want to do and I'm not going to, but I feel like I've been trying to do this for a long time now and it's obviously not working. Maybe it's my anxiety or I have a more a warped perception of what I actually mm. am doing. And she was also saying that when you're trying to gain weight, it's not about really how you're feeling, it's about being consistent and eating regardless of how you feel. I just feel like I've been going in circles in a different way. I think you have. I'm just concerned that um, tracking calories may not be the best way for you to go. Because if you track calories today, I don't see the point unless you're going to track calories going forwards as well. True. I don't know what to say now. I guess this shows that I'm still very easily influenced by everything, and I'm still figuring everything out. I don't know why I feel so frazzled. I'm like, Miss Frizzle, where's my magic school bus? Okay, so you know, initially the video idea was to track my intuitive eating, track the calories, and genuinely in the morning, I thought that tracking my calories today to get a reference of how much I eat was a good idea. And yes, looking back, I didn't think it through properly and my mom pointed it out. That means that I'd have to actually count my calories on a daily basis in order to achieve that daily calorie goal, which is not something that I want to do. <sighs> I can't do it this way. I probably should do it that way. So, so how do I do it? What do I do? And this is why I feel like Miss Frizzle because I decided that I want to put my life, specifically the food and exercise part of my life, online out to the public. And so something like this, I feel like I want to share it. I want to document it. I feel like some people will want to watch it, but I just don't know what I'm doing. And I know that I don't have to know what I'm doing. And it's probably interesting to see the journey of me making mistakes, but I'm not committing to anything. And it's probably annoying for me to say that I'm doing one thing, then not do it, then try another thing, then not do it. Hi, I just got back home, but I need to stop off quickly to get some food for lunch. As in, I'm gonna pick up some food to make lunch. It took me everything in my power and my body to not go to the restaurant downstairs. But I'm gonna be disciplined with my cash, my derulo. Derulo? What is, what is money in Spanish? Derulo. That's just, that's Jason. Demulo. Mula? Okay, but do I want burrata cheese? Disciplined with my derulo. No burrata cheese. Hi, what's uh, up? Before you come in, I've done something. What have you done? It's not good. Tell me, what have you done? Uh, just see for yourself. Get out, what have you done? What have you done? What have you done? What? Tyler, tell uh, me. Yeah, I I didn't think you'd notice. It's, uh, it's subtle, but the sofa's gone. 
What did you do with it? Uh, yeah, I was I was watching RuPaul and I had a glass of water and I knocked it over. So I did the only thing any sane person would do when I just got rid of it. It's water, just clean it! Well, you weren't home, okay? So I didn't have that hindsight. But now that you've said it, maybe it made a little bit more sense. So it's your fault for not being here when I spilled the water on the pillow! This is Alyssa Edwards, and <sighs> 32 years of age. I'm known as... I know we still have a table, right? Yeah, we do. 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 Yeah, Okay, I'm a survivor. I'm not gonna give up. So Valencia made some beef ravioli, and nobody can prove that I didn't do it, so I might have. Natalia's used to having ravioli with just tomato sauce, but this time we're switching it up. I love putting my partners in uncomfortable situations. It's just to clarify, I only have one partner. <laughs> to make the creamy, the creamy, uh, the creamy sauce, I used a lot of milk, some cream cheese, and pesto. So you may be wondering what happened with my frizzle attack. I've decided to keep going with the video and just do a full day of tracking my intuitive eating because I think that that's a fun idea in itself. This video doesn't have to be this massive epiphany of a video. I didn't know anything about calories to be honest. Mm -mm. I'm the worst athlete in the world, but I... The best one. For some people, maybe it makes sense if it's right for you. And I think everyone needs to figure that out. Yeah. Because some people think it's right for them and realize, no, 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 it's not. Don't be in denial. Just understand that it's not for everyone. Mm. Like, it's not for me to try and do the splits. I mean, for years I've tried it, but I can't. I've decided it's not for me. Yeah. And I've moved on from it, because now I do handstands and they're cool as shit. I love that metaphor. Thank you. Don't try to do the splits if the splits hurt your mental health. And your dick. There's no message in here to say you should or you shouldn't do it. Exactly. It, the message is you should learn your body mm -hmm. and yourself. Oh my god, I love that. The connection. Connection and spiritual intuition. Yeah, the spiritual intuition should and the guide ghosts, you. The ghosts. No, ghosts aren't real. No. Aliens are. Okay, the ghosts, the aliens, the spiritual why intuition. You, why do you turn American like for like three seconds? What right? did I say? You're like, and the ghosts. You went the ghost. You like, you like, what? oh, lovely, lovely ghost. <laughs> <gasps> what a domestic beauty goddess. Look at the domestication of this man. <laughs> Get out! Feral. So I stole this chalk bar from my mom's house, but I didn't steal the yogurt. So I think that cancels out my sins. Anyways, this is going to be my very late snack. This is the best thing to ever walk the land, ever. I don't wanna be that one Still a million miles from you So I'm gonna let you go Hey! Welcome! Welcome to our setup, our living room setup. And to end my day of eating, we went to 7-Eleven. I grabbed myself some Kit Kat, Kit Kat ice cream bars. So let's see how much I've actually eaten all day. Let's calculate it now. So this ice cream was 243 calories, lovely. And now I'm gonna add up all of the meals. Don't do that right. Um, I have eaten, oh, this can't be right. I didn't even feel like I ate that much today. Did I do it wrong? What, what did you eat? I, you today I've eaten 3,268 calories. And I'm a little bit shocked because I thought that it would be not that much, but I'm not even like bothered about that. Like this is great, this is great news. I wouldn't say it's that much. You know how stupid this is? Not this. 
the world. These silly calorie calculators are crappery calculators, you know? You eat what you need to eat, not what some calculator on the internet says to do, right? Alright, well, I guess you should like the video now and subscribe to me. What the hell? It's been 10 minutes and I haven't liked it yet? Maybe we can move your body. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Maybe we can move your body.